Hello and welcome to this tutorial on how to set up your David SLS2. This is the first of four videos on how to use your David SLS2 Structured Light 3D Scanner. As you can see, the projector and the camera are already installed on an aluminum rail right out of the box. Now set up your tripod in front of a table and install the aluminum rail on the tripod. Tighten the orientation knob on the tripod to stabilize the rail. Don't worry about the rail's orientation at this time. Now you will need to plug the USB camera and the projector to your computer. The David camera will need a USB port and your projector will need an HDMI port on your computer. You can also connect the projector to a display port or a mini display port with the proper adapters. The SLS2 kit also comes with a VGA cable adapter. Now, we recommend that you use a black table or a black cover while scanning your object. We also recommend that you elevate your object off the table with a black stand. Here, my object is elevated using a 3D printed black ABS stand. Now, if you follow these pointers, the stand and the table will not be picked up by the scanner. Now, with the projector turned on, you must set up the projector as an extended desktop in Windows. Most desktops and, uh, and computers and laptops have function keys to quickly set or check if you are in extended mode. Now my laptop is function plus F4. Now here select extended. Now you can also click your mouse button, right click your mouse button on the desktop and select screen resolution or properties depending on your Windows OS. Here, number one screen is your computer. That should be the main screen. Number two should be the projector. Again, make sure that your screen one is your main screen or else uh, you will not be able to scan. Now with the projector set up, you will need to install the drivers for the David camera. With the USB dongle installed on your computer, go to the USB drive and double click on the batch valve that installs the David camera driver. Now your David camera driver is now installed. Now this concludes the David SLS2 video setup. The second part of the video will cover the calibration process. Thank you for watching.